Today, I'm talking about how to identify your sabotage thought. So your thoughts are really powerful. And I think by now you start understanding that um, what you think and how you, your, your brain thinks, it can really lead to failure and make you fell off the wagon. So today I want you, I want you to start understanding how you can kind of predict your sabotage thought. And um, each time that you're having like a thought that makes you do something that you're not supposed to, um, it's either one of those. So you will probably feel tempted to eat something that you're not supposed to, or you will actually um, eat something that you're not supposed to. You will feel tempted to um, to skip something about this program, not to do a task, that's what I'm asking you to do. and Or you will feel unhappy about the whole dieting process. So those are all um, the reason why you would have like a sabotage thought. So each time that you have a thought that brings you close to those um, sentences, uh, they're a sabotage thought. So you need to understand um, what are the ones that you do the most. And from all those, you need to come up with an answer. So when those happens, you can have like answer before it actually happened. So like, let's say um, when I when I have those thought, it's probably when I'm trying to ha to do a task that I don't like to do or um, I don't want to do. I feel that I want to kind of splurge into food that I'm not, I should not have or binge a little bit just because I don't know, like I, it's almost to reward myself. So you need to look back at everything you do and start realizing like what are those thoughts that what makes you go off the plan or what are those struggles. So I want you to kind of do a reflection today and I want you to journal like all those thoughts that you're having. It could be like a co-worker, it could be at work, could be your partner, it could be like I don't like to throw away food, uh, I don't have time to do my meal planning or um, all those thoughts that you constantly have. I want you to write it down and aside of it, I want you to write down your answer for it and you know, well, okay, my my. I don't like to do that task. Well, for me, I realize that if I'm doing that task beside someone, so I'm not alone to do it, um, I have less tendency to binge or eat stuff I wasn't supposed to. I feel a little bit better about myself. Or maybe you don't like um, the way your work environment is. So maybe you can ask someone at work to um, to fix that or you need to, to make some suggestion and fix your environment if you don't want to keep. So it's almost like a reflection about everything that you learned so far. And I want you to like do it again and just kind of come up with your struggle because everybody's different. So you've done this program for, for 25 days so far. And some people, you know, there's some subject that I talked about that you can really relate and other one that meh, not really. So it's time to kind of put all, all your own sabotage thought together and kind of create something that you can reference to that's for you. So I hope this helped a little bit. And um, the next two days, we'll go a little bit more in deeper about this. So stay tuned for tomorrow. Bye-bye.